the holy grail of Majora's Mask speedrunning was just found. Majora's Mask, the first three days of the game, known as First Cycle, is a required 20 minute section of gameplay that a lot of runners really hate, that uh, is required so that you can get the Ocarina and Deku Mask in order to continue the run. For a long time, there's been theories of skipping this section and breaking out and turning human before the required three days are over. Back in 2021, Turkenheimer discovered a way of doing this using SRM and Ace that allows you to equip another mask and turn human in first cycle. This method to this day is still used in any percent unrestricted. The problem with this is that uh, SRM and Ace is banned in almost every other category on the main leaderboards, making it only useful for any percent unrestricted. Over the last 10 years or so, there's been many other theories of doing this without the use of SRM. This includes the use of a glitch known as Restricted Items, a glitch that allows you to use items as Deku without having to be human. And one of the ways you're able to turn human using this glitch is by equipping a mask. By equipping a mask, Deku Link is able to turn back into human. The problem with this is that over these last 10 or so years of searching for this glitch, there's been no known way of getting a mask as Deku Link in First Cycle. That is, up until a few weeks ago, the glitch hunter known as Glitches and Stuff actually discovered a way by transferring the powder keg from one file to another, it's actually possible to clip into the laundry pool hideout and get the Keaton mask in First Cycle. The problem with this, of course, is that it requires the use of another file in order to transfer powder keg, making it illegal for all RTA speedruns on the board. Thankfully, for the first time in Majora's Mask history, a way of doing this with only a first cycle file was found. Exodus discovered that with a very precise angle, it's actually possible to clip into the Keaton Mask hideout without needing any explosives or anything like that, making it entirely viable to be done on a first cycle file. Additionally, on the Japanese version of the game, Day 3 of the Honey and Darling minigame actually allows you and gives you restricted items as Deku Link, meaning that if we can get this Keaton Mask in first cycle, we can just do Honey and Darling Day 3 and do restricted items and become human in first cycle. This doesn't require any additional files or the use of SRM, meaning that its potential in other categories is vast. This has potential to change multiple speedrunning categories, most notably the 100% no major glitches category. This does not come without routing challenges, of course, though, as despite breaking out of first cycle, we still need the Ocarina, Song of Time, Song of Healing, and Deku Mask, all of which are required by completing the first cycle. Meaning that for this to be useful, we can instead perform human in first cycle and possibly maybe accomplish some quests only possible as human. Once again though, I'd like to say that this glitch was quite literally proven to be possible today, and we probably won't know the full potential of this glitch until at least a few weeks down the line. But now more than ever is the best time to keep a thumb on the Majora's Mask speedrunning community as the most sought after glitch in Majora's Mask is now possible.